guys playing talk, I'm going to make this short and straight to the point. Today's topic is going to be about never date someone who just broke up with their ex. Why do I say this? Because as we all know, we've all been there. Sometimes what happens is when you start dating someone who recently broke up with their ex, they're still not over their ex. So what happens is that you become a rebound. You become their entertainment. Oh, you know what? I'm bored today. I'm heartbroken. I don't want to stay indoors. So you know what? Uh, you know, this person looks pretty good. Let me just go out for some dinner. Maybe go catch a movie. Maybe go watch a game or whatnot. So... You don't want to do that. Um, how would you know when a person is being honest with you? And when you can tell when a person, not that you can tell, let me correct that. But how can you tell? How can you get the truth from a person? Well, we all know, let's just say I recently broke up with my ex. And it's probably about a week or two. When you ask me, when is my last, when was my last relationship? None of the 10 times am I really going to tell you? Oh, just two weeks ago. Because we're now we're like, oh, that's, that's super fresh. It's like an open wound. You're not over that person. What happens with the minute your ex calls you? Guess what? You're right back. Hey, bye, Evie. You're right back with that person. You also have people that have been dealing with their ex for so long that this is the person who they are deeply in love with and they just can't see to detach themselves from that person. So you know what's going to happen? That person isn't going to give you their, their all. Why? Because you still have this distraction back here. You still have this distraction. There's communication. You guys argue over stuff. Hey, guess what? Christmas comes around. Uh, birthdays. Uh, Valentine's Day. They're still sending things to their to that person, to their ex. That person is still involved. So you know what happens? Unless that person moves on. And even if that person moves on, you know what happens? That person is always going to be present in their life. Especially if it's someone that they love that didn't work out for X, Y, Z reasons. Now the question is, well, how do I get the person to tell me the truth? How do I know? I think when for the fellas, when it comes to lady, women, when we are on dates, we tend to talk a lot. And that's a default that we have. So you have to pay close attention. Unless you're dealing with a woman that's honest, then that's different. For men, Men are more, in my opinion, more the listeners than talkers. I don't think you're, you're going to get so much of, I'm going to tell you, that you're going to see that in a man as opposed to a woman. Us, because we tend to talk a lot. That's just the truth. Men, you just got to try to get a feel, see, you know, sometimes... You may end up in a relationship with this person and you are completely blindsided and didn't know all of this was going on. That this person is still dealing with that person and you come to find out two years later when you're already, you know, vested in a relationship. You find out the XYZ reasons and you're like, oh, this person isn't going nowhere. Maybe that their ex moved on and now they're stuck with you. So now it's like, oh, I'm stuck here. You know, although if I wanted to be with that person, I can be with that person because they're very confident that they can be with that person. But that person is always going to be in their life. So, again, just ladies, listen, get, try to get a feel and a vibe. Again, to get that out of a man is pretty hard. I can't sit here and tell you, hey, you know what, I have the answers as far as like for a man because they're more... They're not emotional creatures. They're more closed off. As opposed with us, when we are on dates, we tend to talk a lot, ladies. We talk a lot. Understand? So that's something that we as women, we also have to be a little mindful about that. Be mindful. 
okay? But again, you don't want to get involved or start dating someone who recently broke up with their ex because there's always that chance and possibility of them getting together. So this is my short video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Do not forget to hit the thumbs up, share it, comment below. Don't forget to hit that little bell and subscribe. Uh, any questions, as I always say, you can follow me on Instagram, on Flame Talk. You can drop me a comment or you can email me at flametalk at gmail.com. Bye.